Hey, good morning, everyone. Great to be with you. I'm looking forward to the weekend. I thought we'd finish off this month with looking at some of the one another's in the Bible. You know, how it says love one another, uh, to uh, challenge one another, to submit to one another. We're going to look at some of those. The, the one I want to look at today is found in the book of Mark, where Jesus is saying, salt is good, right? Don't you, you'll appreciate that, right? Forget what the doctors say about cholesterol or hardening of the arteries or whatever salt's supposed to do for you, but it says salt is good. Then he says, if salt becomes unsalty, what can make it salty again? If, you, if your salt's unsalty, then there's nothing else but salt to make stuff salty and you don't have it. So salt is good. Um, if you don't have it, well, it's going to be tough. And then he says, have salt in yourself. So salt is good. It becomes unsalty. What are you going to do? So make sure you have salt in yourself. And then he qualifies it with this statement. Be at peace with one another. There it is. Be at peace with one another. Uh, nothing else to explain it. Just salt is good. Make sure you've got salt and uh, have salt in yourself. And uh, if the salt goes bad, uh, you've got nothing le left. And be at peace with one another. So let me ask you today, has your salt gone bad? Is there a, is there a goodness in you that's, that's depleted, uh, that's been uh, removed? Uh, are you are you a little less patient, a little more, you know, well, what's there? Here, here's the good news. Jesus can make us salty again. Jesus can salt us with the things that we need so that we can have the goodness of God in us. I love that. And then he says, be at peace with one another. You know, I found that I'm less good when I'm out of sorts with Sandy, my wife. Uh, I'm less good when I'm out of sorts with people in my workplace. I'm less good when I'm out of sorts with my government or, you know, I'm fr what? But when I'm at peace with people, when I'm at peace with one another, man, it makes it so much easier for me to be salty, to have the goodness of God in me. And so if you want to experience the goodness of God, you want to experience the salt of God, allow him to pour into you and be at peace with the people around you. You can take those steps. Peace is up to you. So why don't you take some steps today, see what happens, pour out salt on the people around you because they're probably a little less salty as well and looking for something to make them salty again. Well, that's you and me through the power of Jesus Christ. Jesus, thank you. God, you give us the ability uh, to create goodness in our world. And Lord, let it start with me being at peace with people. God, I don't want to be at odds with anybody. So help me to be salt in this world and to make other people feel good and experience the goodness of who you are and the goodness that can be in this world. I pray that today for my friends as well. In Jesus' name, amen. Hey, I sure love you guys. Let's be salt today and let's be at peace with one another. We'll see you next week.